All right, so our next step, as you recall from last time, we set up the invitation and we got our Zoom link. Now it's time to set up emails that will go to everybody once they register for the webinar. So the key here is you want to activate all of this. A confirmation email goes out, a reminder, one hour, one day, one week type of thing, a follow-up email after, and then a follow-up to somebody who did not attend, all right? So they, the system generally creates a template for you, and then you can add data to it. So um, let's take a look at, at the raw data it gives you. All right, so this just says we're going to click on this. You're going to make sure that's clicked, okay? So yes, good, I want that. I want that to happen. It's pretty well what you're saying there. And then confirmation email, okay, so if you go to edit, you'll notice there's the topic, there's a gap where you can add more, and I'm going to show you an example of that, and then a gap you can add more. But in general, this is giving them automatically all the data they need. You just may need to make sure that you've clicked send confirmation email, okay? You just want to make sure that all of these are clicked to yes. You can, if you want, even send yourself a preview email, and that will come to your inbox as if you were registering. So let me just take you to peek at our live system, for example, and take a look. So you'll notice again, topic, there's YMDD. So that's something that you'll, your um, person involved in the program is going to receive. This is why I like an acronym and then the spelling out of the of the program then hey welcome to the next class in the blah program get ready to whatever your benefit is for replay class notes and bonus materials in our case right i have instructions on on getting into the system but um in your case um, you won't. You're going to be sending it to them. But you can have things like your phone number here, whatever you want. This is something that will go out to them all every single time. But now in the email settings, let's take a look at this. And so let's say here's a confirmation email. You'll notice I filled out some data here, right? Because I have things that I need to tell you. So circle all the dates on your calendar and be ready for an exciting journey, all right? So remember, we've set the 12 dates. I want them to do this. Then check in often to our community. The latest updates gets announced there first. And what's this? This is our, our I'll say, our private Facebook community, okay? And then uh, replays will appear in your member area, which the, you have. As you're building this, you will not. So you'll you can just say something like, replays will be sent to you after they have been completed. And then if you need to submit questions for the Q&A class, send them here. And as you know, I am heavy into um, the program JotForm. And so you can use that to um, get data from them. I love this because I use it for uh, questions. I use it for after class surveys. I use it for all sorts of stuff. And so it's one of my favorite tools. So you want to start to look at it. And then I have no additional information at the bottom. Okay. And so um, I'm going to click save. My save is actually um, lower here. Okay, cool. And then you'll complete that, right? Now, pretty well. So reminder, send one hour one day before, right? So t same type of thing. You can click these up here. So send one hour before, one day before. Now, normally, you like for Message to Millions program, I have this clicked on because it might be four weeks before the class, right? In this situation, in general, it's a weekly class. But you know what? I done hurt. More reminders the better. And you'll notice again, all I did here was repeat the same um, data uh, as I had in my other. Okay? And I'll just click save. And that's it. Generally, the system preloads everything, right? Maybe in the you missed a class, maybe you want to add something like, you know, uh, we're sorry that you were unable to attend. Um, our webinar, I could say uh, the YMDD um, class, okay? You can get more specific, whatever you want to say here. 
Um, and, it, and it says it here that you're unable to attend the YMDD program. Check in often. Okay, replays will appear here. Um, if you have questions, load them here. Okay, so um, that's a, uh, um, a, a cool thing to do. All right, so then you'll just save that. And your emails are ready to go for the entire program. And you don't even have to worry about getting fancy. This is why in the beginning, we don't need to have an autoresponder just yet because the system is going to do most of the work for us. All right, so that's it for emails and I will see you uh, in the next uh, training. Bye for now.